So they will have the retroactive payments from August 1st, 2023 to January 31st, 2024. And then the 3% applied for February on. So they would have received all that is due to them by the payroll cycle in February. Madam General Secretary, mm -hmm. uh, having trotted along yesterday, listening to what the workers were saying, there there this there's a skepticism on their part that the QWI will come through with this. Mm -hmm. Because you know they say a promise is a comfort. Yeah, and as I said today it's Thursday, if the university gives a commitment to make payments today and the university does not honor that commitment today, then the workers have the power. I don't think that the university want to relegate the position that it is now in to honor its commitment to workers having to exercise the kind of force that we have seen for the last few days. Not so soon. Give them time to forget. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much. You.